Nicki Minaj will reportedly not be working with Erica Banks anytime soon after her alleged collaboration request was rejected. Kyverse Tyler, CEO of 1501 Entertainment, claimed that Nicki avoided Erica because the Texas rapper shaded her about the skill level of the female rappers she chose to work with. I love Nicki, but I feel like I've been trying to connect with her for so long and I feel like she's kind of ignored me, she said. And I feel like it entertains girls who don't even know how to rap. And my feelings hurt. While she declined to name any names, Banks coyly added, you all know what girls can't do in rap. When you get the girls out here who really do it. Now, some people might get mad at me for saying that, but it's the truth. Nicki Minaj has expanded her Pink Friday 2 World Tour by adding additional shows in several North American cities and new overseas shows in Europe. Minaj added a total of 13 fresh dates. New North American dates include shows in Atlanta, Boston, Brooklyn, Chicago, Nashville, and Toronto, while international dates include stops in Amsterdam, Cologne, Copenhagen, Glasgow, Manchester, Paris, and Stockholm. The first leg of the tour, featuring acts from the US, UK and Europe, was announced last year and will kick off on March 1 in California. Tickets for the new dates will go on sale at 9 a.m. local time on Friday, January 19. Minaj released her fifth studio album, Pink Friday 2, on December 8, 2023, which serves as a sequel to her debut album, Pink Friday, in 2010. Pink Friday World Tour Dates 2 March 1st Oakland, California, Oakland Arena March 3rd Denver, Colorado, Ball Arena March 8th Las Vegas, Nevada, T-Mobile Arena March 10th Seattle, WA, Pledge Climate Arena March 13th Phoenix, Arizona, Footprint Center March 15th Inglewood, California, Rolling Loud California New Orleans, Louisiana, Smoothie King Center March 20th Atlanta, Georgia, State Farm Arena March 21st Atlanta, Georgia, State Farm Arena, March 22nd, Orlando, Florida, Amway Center, March 24th, Nashville, Tennessee, Bridgestone Arena, March 26th, Charlotte, North Carolina, Spectrum Center, March 28th, Newark, New Jersey, Prudential Center, March 29th, Philadelphia, Pennsylvania, Wells Fargo Center, March 30th, New York, New York, Madison Square Garden, April 1st, Washington, D.C., Capital One Arena, April 2nd, Baltimore, Maryland, CFG Bank Arena, April 4th, Brooklyn, New York, Barclays Center, April 5th, Hartford, Connecticut, XL Center, April 7th, Raleigh, North Carolina, Dreamville Festival, April 8th, Boston, Massachusetts, TD Garden, April 10th, Boston, Massachusetts, TD Garden, April 12th, Columbus, Ohio, Schottenstein Center, April 13th, Milwaukee, Wisconsin, Pfizer Forum, April 17th, Montreal, QC Bell Center, April 18th, Toronto, on Scotiabank Arena April 20th, Detroit, Michigan, Little Caesars Arena April 24th, Chicago, Illinois. United Center April 25th, Chicago, Illinois, United Center April 27th, Minneapolis, MN Target Center April 30th, Toronto, on Scotiabank Arena May 1st, Brooklyn, New York, Barclays Center May 9th, Houston, Texas, Toyota Center May 11th, Dallas, Texas, American Airlines Center May 12th, Austin, Texas, Moody Center May 13, Oklahoma City, Oklahoma, Paycom Center May 23, Amsterdam, Netherlands, Ziggo Dome May 25, Manchester, UK, Co-op Live May 26, Birmingham, UK, Resorts World Arena May 28, London, UK, The O2 May 29, Glasgow, Scotland, OVO Hydro May 30, Manchester, UK, Co-op Live June 1, Paris, France, Accor Arena June 2, Amsterdam, Netherlands, Ziggo Dome June 4, Cologne, Germany, Lanxus Arena June 5, Cologne, Germany, Lanxus Arena June 7, Berlin, Germany, Mercedes-Benz Arena June 9, Paris, France, Accor Arena June 11, Copenhagen, Denmark, Royal Arena June 12, Stockholm, Sweden, Tele 2 Arena, she wanted to put Nicki Minaj on her record I don't have time. That's why you called me a liar. She called me a liar because I said during Zoom calls that I would connect with Nikki's people. Which she did, her husband and I are great, Tyler said. I reached out to them and Nikki was like, I'm not having sex with them. She mutilated me two years ago. Nikki's from Queens, so she's not coming back and messing around. It's unfortunate, not only that, 
but you're upset with me like you know me or love me Erica Banks doesn't know me personally. After hearing Kay Tyler's comments, Erica Banks hopped on to the Neighborhood Talks Instagram comments section to set the record straight with a scathing response. Stop lying through your cow-ass teeth. All you do is lie, that's how you lost your position in 1501, 90 days later, she wrote. They don't even respect you in Atlanta because you're a joke bitch, you've mentioned my name and talked to me since you met me and still, he didn't do anything for you. Pull my cock out of your mouth for a moment. The origins of the rift between Nikki and Erica stem from a 2022 appearance on Revolt's Big Facts, where the 25-year-old shaded Nikki's rap collaborators while expressing her frustration at not being able to get a feature from the queen herself. If you find this content suitable for you and you will like to have more contents like this please take some time to subscribe, turn on notification button so that you will be the first to watch the next video, like, comment and share this video. Thanks for watching.